Hi everybody, Dr. Joseph Cipriano here. I uh, just want to let you know the next giveaway, what we're doing, is going to be another $200 giveaway. Um, this time, in order to win that $200, what we need, we need a little help from you. So we're coming up with our new merchandise store and we need an idea, a very creative idea for a t-shirt to be put out there. So. When trying to win this money for the next giveaway, I need you obviously to be subscribed to the channel, to like the video, but then also comment on what creative idea or slogan should be for the next t-shirt, or for the actually the first t-shirt um, for the Dr. Joseph Cipriano channel. So I'm looking forward to hearing these creative ideas. Uh, have a good one and obviously the most creative idea for the t-shirt will win. Enjoy the video. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> if you were to describe the wide strap to somebody who's never had that done before, what would you tell them? Um, it's a very unexpected feeling, but it's overall it good. Hi everybody, I'm Dr. Joseph Cipriano, and today we have our patient here. Now, as I was reading everything, I mean, we're looking at from like head to knees in pain. Okay, so once a week headache, mm -hmm. and when you get, or is it more of a migraine or more of a headache? It's, it's very random, it just depends on the day. Okay, so a little bit random now, but when you do get it, it's an all day, like once you have it, you're not getting rid of it? Yeah, most of the time. Okay, until the end of the day. But still, once a week, and you told me that was roughly starting from right around 2017. Yeah. Okay, so that's been going on for a long time now. Um, also, so there was neck pain, there was also pain going into the right shoulder you're having a little bit of issues mm -hmm. um, but you are in school in cosmetology yes. school so you guys you got to realize arms are up you know doing hair doing just probably a blow dryer round brush just to coloring just a million different things that you're doing so your arms are always up so definitely can understand that we've had many um, you know hairdressers thrown here so I can definitely help with that um, upper back pain you marked off the only thing that you really didn't have, middle back, you did not have pain yeah. at. But then we're having lower back pain, hip pain, and then knee pain. Yes. Okay. So, <laughs> let's go ahead and let's get, it, <laughs> let's get a baseline. Let's see how everything's going. Um, let's start with the range of motion. I'll have you look all the way up at the ceiling. Any issues with that? It's a little tight, like right here. On the right side? Yes. Okay. Look all the way down to the floor. Any issues there? I think it's more down my neck. More down, okay. And then if you're to bring one ear to one shoulder, on the other side. Any it's issues? a little tight. A little tight? Yeah. And then if you rotated. It's, it's just tight. Just tight? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to have you sit up nice and straight for me. We're going to push down on the top of the head. Any pain with that? Not really. Good. Any pain with that? Mm-hmm. Good. And to the other side. Any pain there? Not really. Okay, good. All right, I'm gonna have you stand up for me. I want you to bend forward at the waist. Any pain when doing that? Um, like right here and then my upper back. So, okay. Mm -hmm. So right in through there. So right in through the lumbar spine, roughly L1 to L3. If you're to lean back like this, any pain with that? It's more my lower back then. More the lower mm -hmm. back? Okay. And then if you're to bend to the side, any no, not that side. No, and the other? It just pulls a little bit. Pulls? Okay. And then if you were to rotate, any issues with that? Uh, just my right shoulders. Your right shoulder? Yeah. Okay. Alrighty. So, I am going to have you lay face down for me. Okay. So, how I like to start all the adjustments, we're going to scan the entire body from that cervical spine, going all the way down to the feet, and then we're going to be checking that symmetry from the right side, comparing it to that left side. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. Now let me know if anything when I'm palpating, if this is tender to the touch, okay? So when we push into the neck. And then it was right there. It was more on the right? Mm -hmm. Okay. So some pain in that cervical spine on the right. Now in the thoracic, how's this feeling? Pretty good. Pretty good? Good. So we're going from the thoracic spine, now going into that lumbar spine. Right there, it starts hurting. Okay. So right there, mm -hmm. we're looking at right around L4 with that. Now we're coming into those SI joints. Any pain on that right SI joint? A little. A little. Any pain over the sacrum? Mm -hmm. 
Any pain over the left side, John? On the right side. On the right side, okay. So a little bit of pain that's going to that right side. Now we're gonna come down here and we're gonna check the leg length out. So we're pulling a little bit short on that right side, as you guys can tell. When we scan up the body, so it's pulling, her hip is hiking a little bit up here and just a little bit higher up on that right side right through here. But we're gonna go through and get that worked out for you. Um, let's go ahead, we're gonna pull out that hypervolt. We're just gonna relax the back before we get you adjusted. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started here. Okay, so as you guys know, I like to start every adjustment in that cervical thoracic spine here. I actually even just felt that move when I, <laughs> when I pushed in there. All right, so we're gonna do a T1 on that left side here. Good. We're gonna drop down, T2 on the right. I always like to start that and we just open up uh, that nerve pathway, taking all those pressure, taking that pressure off, you know, allowing the body to function and to heal as it's intended. Okay, so I'm gonna have you take a deep breath in and exhale out. Good, one more time, deep breath in and out. Good, okay. So let's come back down here and let's take a look at that leg length. So it's gotten better. Still a little short though on the right. We're gonna go right to that sacrum first. Stabilize right here. Raise the right leg up as high as you can. Any pain, tenderness, tightness with that? Not really. Okay, relax. And raise the left side. How does the left side feel compared to the right? It's better. Okay. It definitely went up a little bit higher too. So what we're gonna do, I'm gonna want you to cross your right foot over your left foot. Okay, so the table's gonna come up from below. So we're going to do that P to A drop and we're going to do it with that counterclockwise torque so we can get that sacrum back to midline here. Uncross. Bend this knee. Good. Raise that leg up for me. How does that feel? A little better. Good. So we got a little bit better through there, but I don't like a little bit. I like it to be completely cleared out, and if it's not, you're gonna find the cause and why it's not 100%. So I want you to lay on your side, and I want you to face me. Good. We're gonna bend that top leg. Give me that bottom arm, we're just gonna roll you. There you go, right there. Perfect. There we go, flip to the other side. There we go, lay flat on the back. 
Yeah. Okay, so now we're going to do that leg pull. Um, you'll feel some release in the ankle, the knee, going up to that hip. So we first did that prone thoracic, then we just did the standing, now we're going to do that anterior. So from here what I want you to do, take a deep breath in, and exhale hopefully. <clears throat> Good. Okay. So I'm going to have you relax, we're going to get to that wide strap. Now this is going to be the first time ever getting this done, correct? Yes. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> and relax. Good. Okay, so with the wire strap, you're gonna you're gonna get that decompression going all the way down. <laughs> relax. How did that feel? Um. <laughs> It was like it hurt, but it was like good. It was like, good yeah. hurt. <laughs> it was a good hurt. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Just relax for a moment. You feel that gets a lot of movement there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That that reduces a lot of pressure and decompresses that spine. It pulls the nerves. It pulls apart, and it allows the nerves, to, you know, to remove that pressure in between, going all the way from that cervical spine up top, going all the way down to that lumbar spine. So I'm gonna have you come on up. Okay, so if you were to describe the wide strap to somebody who's never had that done before, what would you tell them? Um, it's a very unexpected feeling, but it's overall it good. Now, you've been adjusted before. Yes. How was this? Like, how was getting, like, that wide strap, like, how, how would that be different compared to someone who's never... I guess had of that decompression uh, technique. My neck definitely decompressed a lot. That, <laughs> that was the main thing that popped. That was like everything that yeah. I heard. That was my neck. Yeah. yeah. I mean, you hear it a ton a lot more in your mm -hmm. neck just because your neck is a lot closer to yeah. your ears. How are you feeling? Pretty good. Good? Yeah. That's what I like to hear. <laughs> if anyone is looking to schedule an appointment, uh, just go right to the website, drjosephcipriano.com. Um, love to get you in here. Have a good one, everybody.